The Beloved Community International Expo is an all-encompassing experience for global citizens to unite in celebration of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s love-centered vision of the Beloved Community, where peace and harmony for all cultures can be achieved through nonviolence. The Expo is happening this Saturday at the King Center, and here to tell us more about it is Dr. Bernice A. King. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Glad to be here. Okay, so what I understand is that the King Center is going to be turned into the world's house. Mm -hmm. What does that mean? Can you describe that for us? That means that uh, there will be representatives from different nations um, in the streets in front of our campus and on our campus uh, to showcase who they are as a culture. And the objective is to create an environment, an atmosphere, where individuals can come and learn about the different cultures. Mm. And, and so we wanted to create this environment because looking at the current state of the polarization and divisiveness yeah. in our world, mm -hmm. we wanted to create this kind of environment to say, hey, if we do what my father uh, spoke about doing, you know, urged us to do, which is we must learn to live together as brothers and sisters or together with parish as fools. So if we'll learn about each other, if we come to an understanding about each other, an appreciation about each other, uh, then we can create a better humanity. And so we have a kid zone. Uh, there'll be face paintings and, and uh, um, scavenger hunts and, and, and other things for the kids. We have a DJ. Uh, awesome. Of course, you have to have food for people. Of course, and that's <laughs> uh, what I'm excited so about. So there, there, there will be f uh, food trucks, but also Many of the nations bring some of their own food so mm. that you can taste uh, uh, their, their, their culinary. And, and then we have um, entertainment from those different spaces. Some will be dance, some will be music uh, from those different nations as well. I will be signing two, two children's books. One is about my mm. mother. Uh, the other is it starts with me with a little girl by the name of Mora on the cover. Happens to be a black girl. Uh, with a shirt that says, Be Love, and the, the title is It Starts With Me. So we want to teach young people how to center themselves in love in everything that they do. Love is not like mammy, pammy, yeah, yeah, you just kind of overlook that, whatever. <laughs> yeah. no, no. You know, love is strong, it's mm -hmm. courageous. Uh, love is understanding. Love is kind. And so this is, this is what we're hoping to accomplish when people leave there, you know, that it will set them ablaze to, to realize that I have to be that change, I have to be that love-centered person. Well, you just about answered all of my questions with that incredible answer. But I uh, have one follow-up. I was watching the videos from last year's event and seeing the little passports that people oh, can yeah, fill they out have to, when they yeah, walk yeah, to the yeah, different yeah. booths. We want to give, we wanna give that little experience, because the reality is, most of the world, people that live in the world, will never see other parts of the yeah, world. Yeah, that's true. We wanted to make sure that people who don't have an opportunity, at least at this point in their life, to travel the world, the world can come to them and, and give them a little idea. First, you got to get a passport. Right. You, you can't go to this place, you can't yeah. go to that one without your passport. Now, some, there's a visa, of course. Okay, yeah, uh, but that's true. <laughs> not the real passport. Not the real just, ones, just, just to clarify. Just the Beloved Community <laughs> International Expo passport. There we go. <laughs> Dr. Bernice A. King, thank you so much for being here. I'm excited about this event. I'll have to come see you all. And if you would like to go, too, it is happening this Saturday from 11 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. at the King Center on Auburn Avenue. Thank you. Thank you.